Siamo qui al Museo della Scienza e della Tecnologia di Milano, museoscienza.org, per incontrare Gene Serban, l'ultimo uomo sulla luna, the last man on the moon. E dietro questa porta, adesso andiamo a parlare con lui. You have promised to describe the many aspects of your journey to the moon. As I was reading your biography, The Last Man on the Moon, uh, one item stood out. Um, at a certain point, you write something in the lunar soil. Could you tell us that story? Well, it was, uh, I parked the lunar rover uh, before we were going to depart. After a little more than three days on the building, I parked the lunar rover because it was the only thing that was controlled from the ground. Everything else we did was a television, and they wanted to record our liftoff. So I parked it about three quarters of a mile behind where the lunar module was. And, and, and I got out of the rover and I don't have it. It was not planned, I had no idea what was this. But I put my daughter's initials TDC in the sand, Teresa Dawn Cerner. And her initials are there. Someone said, how long will they be there? And I said, forever. However long forever there is, there's no rain, there's no wind, there's nothing that's going to, except cosmic radiation that's going to blow those emissions away. How long will the flag be there? How long will my footsteps be there? Forever. Unless someone goes there and covers them all. So do you consider yourself the first writer on the moon? <laughs> I never thought about it that way. You know, I just, I just, uh, uh, my goal in that book was, for me to share with you the answers to all the questions I know you have, and you know what they are. And it, it was, I wanted to be me talking to you. I wanted to be you out there on my spacewalk in Gemini 9, feeling what I felt. I wanted to be you on the, on the moon, looking back at the earth, so you could answer the question, how does it feel, what did you think, did you believe in God, did you feel we're closer, you know. And that was my goal. I don't know how close I came, but I didn't want it. I didn't want it to be a technical book. This is what's like this book. Baloney. I want it to be sitting here and answering all those questions we have. You did trying to have you be here as we lift it off. Wonderful. And Thank you. Mission accomplished. And they're making they're making the documentary. Yes. So Last man on the moon. That's it. I'm yes. hoping oh, it comes out in the spring. It will be. I'm in touch with it. And it's some good reviews so far. Yes. <laughs> Can I ask you to? I can't. That's very kind of you, sir. Okay. Just sign it here. Huh? Yes. Uh, October 2014. You know, I wrote a book in 2004 in somebody's book. I lost, I lost 10 years of my life. It's okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay.